me, it was a no-brainer that I was going to vote for Hillary Clinton. I bought into hook, line, and sinker the media narrative of who Donald Trump was, who his supporters were, and what he was all about. And then finally, I posted that I would never be able to understand how anyone could vote for a man who stood before a cheering crowd and mocked a reporter's disability. One person responded to me. And she said, look, I'm not trying to start a problem with you. I'm not trying to have a fight. I'm just asking, have you seen this? What happened next changed my life forever. Uh, it was a compilation of footage of Donald Trump and numerous, numerous circumstances throughout the years doing that exact same voice and that exact same gesture. And it became very clear that this had nothing to do with the reporter's disability. My brain was saying, oh my God, I don't think he mocked that reporter's disability, but my heart was saying, yeah, but we hate him, but we hate him, but we hate him. This presented an even bigger conundrum for me because if Donald Trump did not mock a reporter's disability for me, why did CNN tell me that he did? <laughs> because CNN had never lied to me before. So why all of a sudden did CNN start lying on that day? So what I chose to do was go to work. And when I came home from work, I would get on my computer and I would watch videos and I would read stories and I would research as much as I could possibly research. And what I discovered was astounding. All of this fear and all of this terror that I was experiencing which was affecting the way that I feel, was a carefully crafted narrative. But why would they do this? I thought that they cared about the gay community. I thought that they cared about black people. Black people and white people don't have to hate each other. Citizens don't have to hate the police. Gay people and straight people don't have to be at odds with one another. This is all a manipulation. And I was thinking about this, how am I going to wake people up? How, how do I capture people's attention? And I felt on this day in April of 2018 like I'd been struck by lightning as I was out jogging. I felt and heard in my own mind this, this voice say, once upon a time, I was a liberal. <laughs>